Up next, the Mitsubishi Lancer. Now, Mitsubishi in the last few years has decided to set up their own dealerships and sell cars directly to Canadians. This is one of them. It's the Lancer GTS. Now, we don't have the base model available for us to drive, but keep in mind the GTS and the Lancer both share the same engine. Starting price is $16,598. Even without the rear spoiler, side skirts, and larger wheels, the base Lancer has an aggressive stance. The front grille and headlights look menacing very similar to the Mazda 6. By the way, the Lancer comes with standard 16-inch wheels. Most of the competition comes with 15-inch. Now here's something we're not used to seeing in this class. On the base model of the Lancer, the back seats don't split and fold. Huh? The interior is simple and stylish and has a lot of standard safety features like front, side, and curtain airbags, plus knee airbags. Power windows are standard, but power door locks and air conditioning are sold as part of a package on the base model. Tilt steering is standard, but not telescopic. Now on paper, the Lancer looks pretty good, 152 horsepower, but a lot of that power comes on at higher revs, so it seems a little bit gutless off the line, so you're always having to drive it hard and put your foot into it. That might explain the poor fuel rating. I really like the sporty, updated, well laid out, easy to use dash. The seats are very comfortable and there's good outward visibility. If you get the Lancer in the base model, we recommend that you get the air conditioning package. It also includes ABS and electronic brake distribution. The Lancer is one of the few in this class to give you front and rear disc brakes as standard equipment. Traction control is not available. 